Hi, my name is Andrew Christensen. I'm the Bible worker at Park Rapids Church. And I want to introduce to you my friend Barry. I've been studying the Bible with him uh, for a couple of years now, and um, he has an awesome story to tell. Okay, well, I got this uh, tract in the mail, actually, called The Edge of Time. And uh, it came in the mail, but it wasn't addressed to me. It was addressed to somebody else that I didn't know who it was. So. Uh, threw it on my table for kitchen table for probably a month before I read it. Eventually read it and uh, it just grabbed a hold of me, I guess. And in the back of that tract, it was an Adventist uh, publication. Eventually, Andrew shows up at my shop <laughs> and he had this card that I had filled out. Yeah, so when I showed up, um, following up on that card, I didn't know who you were. I knocked on your door and you weren't home and you poked your head out of the your shop and I came in and we talked for a while and you know at first you you know you didn't really want Bible studies and I could have just left um, you know if I if I gave up you know and got discouraged and but we can't um, and so I you know kept talking you were asking a lot of and questions you know, kind of gave you some carrots you know to uh, lead you on um, to see if you wanted to study and at the end of the conversation after a half an hour or so you you, uh, you said, okay, yeah, let's study. Through and that, so, we began to have Bible study. and um, Throughout different times and studies, I would come and we'd get to the Sabbath or different, different times and you'd ask me, hey, you know, do I need to do this? You know, and I'd say, well, this is what the Bible says. This is what I would do. But that's, that's up to you to decide, you and God. And um, I wouldn't push that. And the Holy Spirit would just do His work. So... And, been a little slow process, but that's it's been a good foundation, you might say. A few weeks before you decided to be baptized, mm -hmm. and um, you know you'd been coming to church for a while, um, you know pretty faithfully, and that, that question is in the back of my mind. You know, should I, you know, finally ask him to, you know, join the church? And I almost, I almost did. You know, I said, well, no. And that next week, you said, you know. Uh, what do I need to do to, to join the church, you know? And, and it's just awesome to see the Holy Spirit work. Uh, mm -hmm. Crying out to the Lord really was just direction. And he sends you a book. <laughs> there, there it is, yeah. a little tract in the mail to get it all started, you know? Yeah. So amazing. So that stuff does work. <laughs>